The Spy in the Sky Suite is the oldest piece of music on the album. It originates from 94 or 95, which means it's been running around in my head for longer than it hasn't. Uh, but finishing it off and linking the bits together was always in the too hard basket until I came up with the way to make it completely over the top, which was uh, the endless guitar and synth solo duel that uh, happens at the end of part three. I described the music with someone once as out of space spy music. And then I came across a, uh, a 1950s B-grade Cold War film called Spy in the Sky. Uh, by all accounts, it's a pretty disappointing film, but the poster was fantastic, uh, so I stole the title. constant struggle between uh, unbridled ambition and uh, fatigue and self-doubt. Lots of references to Churchill and Samuel Johnson, who could, who articulated the situation a lot better than I could. Hey Bob, can we get Shatner? I was not my first choice to perform the vocals on Spy in the Sky, part three. I wrote the lyrics, but when I heard that line, the scourge of the city, I spy in the sky, uh, against that music, I heard a speaking voice. I heard William Shatner. And I wanted the, the grandeur and the majesty of Admiral Kirk. It's funny we should talk about this right now because it's a bit after four on a Friday afternoon and exactly this time, LA, LA time, Billy Sherwood and his mobile studio will be at the Shatner residence recording Shatner's vocals for this song. And I know exactly what it's going to sound like and I have no idea what it's going to sound like. I can't wait to hear it. A solitary morning is waiting to share. The dog barks throughout the day. From breakfast to dinner, he gnaws to the bone. Companion who makes his prey. And he's such a... Dreaming of rest, which I scarcely expect any time. 